This is the real Tom Rose, and we're dealing with two issues of punctuation here in the same sentence. Um, first of all, uh, there's one question about how to, how to properly punctuate the conjunction and. The correct, correct way to punctuate the conjunction and is you have some sentence, you have comma, and, which is the same way to punctuate any conjunction, and you have the rest of the sentence. So this first comma is necessary, and we can get rid of anything that doesn't have it, which is all of the answer choices leaving only the first one. Now, if you were wondering whether the second comma was necessary, you could also ask that question. You don't have to figure it out to get this right. But the second comma is also necessary. And the reason why is because we're dealing with a modifier. It's as these machines became increasingly popular among the sporting set in Paris, clubs were formed and races were run along the Champs-Élysées. That whole modifier, which modifies uh, the following phrase, um, needs to be offset with commas. So this first comma is important because it matches the second or back comma on that modifier. So that second comma also needed, um, which would mean this one was still in the running and so was that one and so was the original, but the second one was doubly out.